All right, well, um, we're on a draw this game, second game of round three. I think this hand is keepable. It's a little slow. We have three lands, but we do have an Azorius Charm to either cycle or, you know, get some tempo back if we absolutely need to. I'm mostly keeping it because we have Martial Law and Double Planes. Ooh, so he had the Overgrown Tomb. He might have been passing to his thing because I think we saw that in pack two. Ew, Lotleth Troll. Well, we could really get him here if he dumps a bunch of cards to it and we either Martial Law it or, you know, Azorius Charm it away or something. But yeah, that card is scary. Okay, so not doing much this turn, it looks like. Three drop would be nice. Guess a land is okay. Definitely have a slow hand here. Maybe that'll incentivize him to uh, pump up his troll a bit. Yep. Corrosed to monitor. Hmm. Dramatic Rescue is a pretty good card here for us. Um, I think we just want to flash in Hussar Patrol. It's probably not worth it. I'm trying to think. So if we flash in the Hussar Patrol, and um, we'd likely just block the Crows to monitor, and then we can start, you know, Martial Line it next turn or something. I guess this is worse for us if he has some sort of removal, but, you know, or pump. And we have Dramatic Rescue and Azorius Charm, so I think we can stabilize. I want him to commit some resources to this card so we can get value. Stab wound, okay. Soul Sword and Spirit's not bad here. Is it super obvious if I detain the Lotless Troll? No. It's only a little bit super obvious that I have Swift Justice. So again, he could have Pump. Um, at least we gain some life if we do this. Uh, I hope this isn't... Oh, Knightly Valor? Yuck, yuck, yuck. Okay, so we're going to take a wee bit of damage this turn. Drawing a land uh, would be pretty clutch here. Like, I think actually it doesn't matter what land we draw, but any land. All right, because now we can do Martial Law. And we can Dramatic Rescue the Corros to Monitor. And I'm not going to block any of his stuff with my Soul Sworn Spirit since I'm bouncing his dude. So we'll just do that now. Jeez. All right, this guy has some strong cards in his deck. He's just sacking it. It could be bad news for us. Bad news bears. So we can detain the crows to monitor. Or the guild mage, I mean. I think we might have to do that. Because otherwise he gives all of his stuff evasion and we just die. 
It's kind of scary. All right, well, I guess we'll put Swift Justice on this dude. Um, yeah, I think we're probably dead. So we'll put, I guess we'll kill one of his things because we're probably gonna have to use his Aureus Charm on this. Um, and this puts us to one. So we have the option of going to one or gaining life. Um, hmm. I think we have to gain life here. I don't know what we'll draw next turn, but uh, maybe that's wrong. Because it was already killing that. I don't know, just going to one is bad news. Because if he just like throws down stab wound or something, we just die. We already saw one stab wound out of him. To be honest, if he stab wounds, we're probably just dead anyways. Yeah. We've already used our dramatic rescue, so we are way dead. All right, well, he certainly has some bombs in his deck. How should we handle that? I think we probably need to put in cancel because that's one way of dealing with them. And I guess I keep forgetting to put in the guild gate. I don't, we don't really need it, but I guess it does stabilize our mana a bit. Um, so yeah, I think cancel probably comes in. We didn't see any removal out of him, like straight up removal. Uh, there is a stab wound, I take it back. Wow. Yeah, so Mizium skin, Mizium skin is definitely staying in. I think Swift Justice um, probably should stay in. So we either could take out a creature, but I don't like doing that. We could take out an Ethereal Armor because black, um, green probably has a good amount of ways to deal with it. 